What's going on guys? This is the Works WX255L semi-automatic electric screwdriver and I've got to tell everyone this product is a winner. The manufacturer has really delivered a unique product. Before getting into it, let's take a quick look at what comes in the box. It's semi-automatic and does come with a six round magazine. Uh, basically to change bits, pull back the slide, rotate, Slide forward, now we got a Phillips bit on there. Now we got a square bit on there. So it's really uh, really ergonomic to operate. And of course, let me show you a few other things here. You're not limited to what comes with it. It will actually take any you know standard quarter inch bit. Here's a T30 Torx, so just pop that out. Put your magazine back in. Look at that, now we got our Torx bit right up front there. Conversely, if you don't want to use that at all, you can remove the screw holder and put any quarter inch bit right in there and it's magnetically held in place. Super convenient, so you can use this like as a drill if you'd like. So overall, I think this is one of those concepts where you're like, why didn't anybody try that before? And they've really executed well. Now, let's say, for example, we want to use this as a drill and driver. So I've got a small, I think that's an eighth inch bit in there, or sorry, three thirty seconds bit to pre-drill our hole. Well, it's not particularly fast, but it will get the job done in a pinch. Oh yeah, forgot. Doesn't hold it in there that well. Again, not exactly what it's meant for, but will work. Let's see if we can drive that. Yes, we can. Not quite enough to countersink it though. Next up, I want to give you guys a little torque demonstration. Here, I'm using my torque wrench at 20, 25, 35, 45, 60, and 75 inch pounds. Let's see what the Torx semi-auto screwdriver can back out. 20 is no problem. Neither is 25. It can back out 35 inch pounds. Forty-five is a struggle, but we did eventually get it done with a couple of nudges. And sixty inch pounds is where this thing calls it quits. This is a very good result and demonstrates this product is more than capable of handling around the home type chores, though I doubt you'll be seeing it in a mechanics cart, but maybe an electrician's bag. Overall build quality on this is really nice. It's surprisingly weighty. Check this out. Back at the handle, we have a nice rubber over mold there. Okay, forward, reverse. One thing it is missing is variable speed. That would have been a nice little addition, but you know, we, uh, we're not dealing with a real expensive piece of equipment here and they really hit a home run with everything else. Oh, of course, there's a little light on the front that is only on and off as you depress the trigger. When we're done for the day, this product charges with a very common and very cheap micro USB cord. I really like the fact works didn't go proprietary here. At the end of the day, I think this product is a home run. I've been around a lot of tools in my life, cheap and expensive, and very few are really that innovative. But this is, and while it's certainly not going to replace an 18 volt drill and driver set, it will definitely punch above its weight class power-wise, and you'll be surprised at just how capable it is.